Hello everyone, welcome back to Math and Zone with Python and today we are going to learn on how we can reshape or transform our data from wide format into long format and from long format uh, into wide format. So I have my data frame uh, and this data set is in the uh, wide format with country names and a GDP for different years. So I'm going to use this data set to show you how we can transform uh, specifically for this wide format into a long format. So let's start. I have loaded my data and uh, uh, let's see the printout there for this data. So this is the data frame that uh, I loaded from the original CSP file. We have the country name, the years and the GDP for different years. Now let's start uh, uh, creating a new data frame with the transform the data from wide format into long format. So we create a new data frame which is the data frame df1 and uh, I'm going to call the melt function basically to transform the data from wide to long format we are going to use the melt function from panda library. So we use pd uh, dot melt. Inside this melt function we have to uh, assign a data frame which we are going to transform and that is the data frame uh, we imported which is this one and uh, we call inside this function df and from this data frame we uh, restrict the column which will uh, act as the id of the column from uh, this data set we have here I'm going to uh, restrict this uh, country names to be stationary and then I will transform the rest so I restrict that using the id underscore variables and the, this id underscore variables is going to be the country name then after that I'm going to uh, label the column for the variable which will be transformed okay so the variable name for a transformed data we are going to be year okay and also I'm going to name the uh, column which will have the corresponding uh, transformed data which is the GDP and that is going to be the value name value underscore name and that is going to be uh, the column with the name GDP. So after that you are done and then command the printout for this new data frame and uh, this data frame is df1 and uh, let's print this one and see if we have managed to transform the data from this original uh, wide format into a long format. Let's now print this one. Yeah that is cool. We have managed to transform our data from the wide format into a long format. You can see we have the country names, we have the years here, and we have the GDP column with the coefficients for the GDP of these uh, countries for different years. Also, we can transform the data from a long format to a wide format, and to do that, we are going to apply the pivot function. That is, we create a new data frame that is df2 equal to uh, df1 because the df1 file is the one which is in the long format. So we are going to transform this one from long format back to a wide format. So df1 uh, dot pivot then uh, inside this pivot function we are going to assign a column which will leave it as a, a fixed column and uh, that uh, column is the country name that is the index uh, equal to country name. Make sure you write a correct name as it appears in this uh, original data frame which we are going to transform from this long format to wide format. So we have the country name as a stationary column and uh, also we are going to transform the data from uh, long to wide and the column which we are going to transform into a wide format is the column for years that is 
uh, each year should make a separate column okay so the columns for which I'm going to generate here is the column for years and then we state the values which will be under this uh, columns for years and the values are going to be taken from the column of GDP so we are done and then let's command the print out for this new data frame so we have the print out for this data frame and now let's print and see if we have managed oh we have an error and this error is years so we made a mistake because the column for years here is the year okay so the name is the year so we have uh, years this is the an error and uh, let's run again okay so you can see the output now we have reshaped the data uh, from long to wide format you can see here so basically uh, you can see if we, we want to compare with the original data set you can see the first country was Argentina here is Argentina then Bolivia Brazil but here we have Brazil Bolivia so uh, when you transform data basically the names here will follow alphabetical order so you can see here the in the original data set Argentina we have Brazil uh, Brazil and Bolivia Bolivia basically come first before Brazil so the arrangement of uh, the transformed data follows the alphabetical order so this is how you can transform your data from a wide format into a long format and from a long format into a wide format so I would like to leave you with a bonus and uh, the bonus is how now you can uh, export the uh, data frame which you have reshaped or transformed into Excel format so how can we do that if we want to export our data frame into the Excel format it's simple for instance here the original data set is in the uh, wide format now I would like to uh, export my data frame for a long format which is the data frame one so just write df1 dot to underscore Excel okay the option is there and inside the Excel we have to write the directory where I want my output file to go so let's consider this directory which I saved my original data set and a, this directory here just click here and a, I have this directory you copy it and then you come here and paste here then put backslash write the name of the excel file which you like to create you can say the name is gdp output dot excel then you can also uh, rename the sheet name in the excel output that is uh, renaming that use the uh, command sheet underscore name then assign the name of the sheet as GDP uh, after that also uh, the index uh, leave it false so these are the commands okay so run and then we have the uh, previous output that we uh, did earlier and now our interest is to see if we have generated a new data frame for the long format okay so let's go to our data file and you can see we have the excel file as a gdp output you can see it okay so this is the output that we generated for the uh, transformed data set from wide format into a long format so this is what i prepared for you today thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like comment and share the content of this video until next time goodbye